I don't know what's going on with Joe Jonas and Demi Moore. Uh, no, I, it apparently is a um, a flirtatious friendship. Why is what a source told Page Six? Why can't her name just be Demi? Because it's Demi. <laughs> I, it's just hard, or you know. Yeah. Well, one insider told us that things were already getting romantic. The well placed source was quick to dispel any rumors of hanky panky. <laughs> oh. Uh. More whose new horror film, uh, this says. More whose nor- new horror film, The Substance, was all the buzz at the, f- at the festival, hosted the um, AMFR gala during the festival where Joe made a surprise appearance on stage alongside his brother Nick. While Nick 31 was scheduled to perform at the event, it was the addition of Joe for his band DNC's hit Kick by the Ocean that got the crowd out of their seats. Moore was seen dancing with Oscar winner Michelle Yao during the song. I did see that video. That was awesome. Moore was later spotted dining with Joe, his brother Kevin, and supermodel Heidi Klum. We're told that Joe is also friends with Moore's stylist uh, Brad Gorski and her manager Jason Weinberg. The new friendship comes on the heels of Joe's breakup with model Stormy Bree after five months of days dating. Uh, he's been busy working on a solo album. This is very interesting. Solo album. We, Even baddies get saddies, he says. That is what I wanted to talk to you about. Even baddies the, get saddies. No, <laughs> no. The, him doing a solo album. Solo I saw album. it over the weekend and I said, oh, we have to talk about this. And it totally slipped my mind. Yeah. That's why the brothers had to cancel their tour. Yeah, they're they're doing their own individual they're stuff. They're breaking up again. The <laughs> brothers aren't being forthcoming recently. No, the they brothers some... are going through another tiff. Let's yeah. call it how it is. Well, they were just all in France together. Sure, sure. Yeah. Wee wee. Wee wee. Wee wee. Um, they're all in France. No, I bet you, look, I think that's so fair. When I bet you France? if one of them gets. When were they we, in France? Like last m- week. Their last month. When you were there? No. Oh, was no, it last no, week no. or last month? Last week you were there. For Cannes. Which was like the end of May. Oh, like it was business. It wasn't. Yeah. They weren't together there for a fun family vacation. Well, it was a concert they had to perform. No, I mean, Joe, like I just said, Joe came out on stage and sang with Nick, so. And but then and then they had lunch with with Kevin and Heidi Klum. They're always leaving out Kevin. <laughs> when they perform, the, I truly think. Well, it was just I'm Nick not going to lie. I truly think Kevin is like the problem in their <laughs> relationship as brothers because I think that. Well, because you think Kevin needs the band. Because I think that Joe and Nick, like, both have their own yeah. thing solo. And Kevin, he very clearly is, like, a part of the band. And I think that, like, I if I had to guess, Joe and Nick sometimes have conversations where they're like, we just want to go off and do our own thing. But what do we do about Kevin? I I think that's fair. <laughs> Kevin's fine. I think that's fair. But I no, also think is, they, I'm just, you know. Yes. I also Kevin think they've great. gotten to the point where now, because of what happened... They can accept that there's gonna be times when they do want to do their own thing, but that doesn't mean like the band is over, you know. And that's okay because everybody should be able to do their own thing. Exactly. It doesn't mean the band is over. Like Joe, I think Joe just went through a major breakup. He's probably got a lot of lot of music in him mm-hmm. that he wants to get out there. And instead of making a full ass Jones Brothers album that's about, that is about Joe's divorce, he's like, I'm gonna do my own solo album, which he should do. Yeah. More more the merrier. Yeah. 